We're police officers. My name's Friday. This is Bill Gannon. Glad you got here. You're the theater manager, are you? Yes, sir. The name is Nash. George Nash. Okay, Rick. Show the officers are back. There's no reason to call the cops. I told you not to. You heard me. Didn't, didn't I say no cops? That's what you said. I don't care what he said. Nobody's going to do a thing like this in my theater. I said I'd take care of myself. Take care of what? Nothing. The creep who burned him. Look at his back. Shut up, Lauren. All right, turn around. Turn around, son. That's bad enough. You can imagine how it'd be if he wasn't wearing a jacket. Just look at it. It's ruined. Acid burns. H2SO4. Sulfuric. It's a good thing he had these other clothes on. Big deal. So you both took high school chemistry. What's your name, son? Rick Schneiderman. Where do you live? 1401 Axtell Avenue. How old are you? 18. Now you. Lorraine Harper. 388, three and a half, Vine Grove. 16. Now suppose you tell us what happened. Look, my back's on fire. If you don't mind, I'd like to get something done about it. I've called for an ambulance. Should be here any time now. Who burned you and why? I don't know. You get acid poured down your back and you don't know why? Because he's a kink. Go hold his head up to the light. You ever have trouble with him before? No more than anybody else. Then you know him. Yeah, I know him. What's his name? Gerald Paulson. How old is he? I guess about 17. Where does he live? I don't know. Mr. Nash? No. I couldn't even get him to tell me his name. When I picked up the phone to report it, he just took off and ran. I'll check him out, Joe. All right, if I use the phone? Uh, would you rather use the extension? Fine, thanks. What happened before he poured the acid on you? Nothing. He was sitting in a row behind us, and the lights went out. Pretty soon I felt something hot in my back, and I jumped up. Then I got my jacket off, and it was all burned. Joe. You're sure it was the Paulson boy who did it? He still had the bottle in his hand. Joe, Central Juvenile Index turned up Gerald Paulson's address from a traffic citation they have on file. Where's he live? Never mind. We'll handle it. Go ahead. I'll get him later. You may get yourself a lot of trouble, son. From Gerald? He's so chicken, he has to do it behind your back. Don't you count on it, boy. Next time, you might do it to your face. <laughs> We took an ADW report while the ambulance crew treated Rick Schneiderman's back. They told us the burns suffered by him were not serious enough to require hospitalization. He was advised to see his own physician. <laughs>